We all know that first impressions make a big difference when it comes to meeting someone. But in business, first impressions can really make a very big difference in terms of what you can accomplish with a business. If you're an entrepreneur and you're knocking on doors and you want to sell your product or service, the door that you come in to and how you come into that door can make a big difference. If you're a person looking for a job or looking for some kind of career opportunity, the door you come in to and how you come through that door can make a big difference. So what you want to do is make sure that you come in the right door and you come in the right way. Now, what does this mean? It means that if you can get a referral, that is a much better way to come in. Now, I don't think you should wait for a referral. I don't think you should stop in terms of uh, trying to make an overture to an organization. But if you have a referral who can bring you in and can give you a recommendation or an endorsement, that's very valuable when it comes to doing business with an organization. If you don't have a referral, the way you come in must be packaged properly. So let's say you're a company and you are pitching an organization on doing business with you. What that means is what you want to deliver when you first meet an organization is a snapshot of who you are and why they should do business with you. You want them to feel right away that they're in good company if they do business with you. You don't want them to feel that, wow, this is not the right organization for me or this isn't the right person for me. So what that means is if you can show references, if you can show uh, some of your work history, some of the projects that you've done, some of the clients that you work for, some of the uh, projects and experiences that you have uh, done that are that are really significant photographs testimonials work samples these kinds of things make a very big difference in helping people understand who you are now you must remember this a lot of people will not look at what you give them to read they will not look at the detail but if you can supply pictures and you can supply something that gets their attention right away that will make a big difference so today we have these tremendous tools called the smartphone and with the smartphone we can send audio we can send video we can send photographs we can take people to live events and, and situations use that when you're connecting with prospects and when you're connecting with career opportunities it might seem like you have to do the traditional thing, but you don't. You can be very creative and use these tools. Now, sometimes people won't respond. Sometimes they'll be taken aback. But I guarantee you, you will make an impression. And that's the key. Make an impression. I have had scenarios where I can't reach somebody and I've sent them a video that says, Hey, John, I know you're real busy. I know you have a lot going on. I'm here on the weekend having a good time at the farmer's market. I thought about you. I thought about trying to reach you. Take a look at what's happening around here. Isn't this interesting? Let's talk when you can. And by and large, someone will respond to that and say, wow, what a great idea. I like the way you, you followed up with me. I like the way you approach things with me. So think about how you can be more creative in your communication. And if you can come in the door the right way, that is important. You see, if you come in the door the wrong way, let's say, for example, uh, you come in the door as a freelancer or as an intern, it might be very difficult for that organization to see you beyond that. So even when you come in at a position that isn't ultimately the position you want to be at, you have to demonstrate that you are at a higher level and demonstrate that your thinking, your work, your relationships, your reach is greater than what's apparent. So think about the people that you're pitching. Think about the organizations that you're, you're trying to serve, that you're trying to sell to, that you're marketing into. Think about the, um, the job opportunities you're pursuing and make sure you come in the door the right way. If you can get a referral, great. If you can't get a referral, come in with the right presentation, the right packaging, the right references, the right story, and that'll make a difference in terms of what you can accomplish with that organization long term. If you like this tip, give me a thumbs up. Let me know that you liked it. Uh, make sure you share it with your network and uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel because I have a lot more coming. 
I'll see you next time.